So students, I am at home six, so I recorded the lesson for you. And we're going to master those one-step equations. Last time, we learned about adding and subtracting them. And we still need to use those steps of drawing a wall through our equal sign, circling the x, and then on this one you would add 7 to both sides. Then, on this other one, you would draw a line through the equal sign, circle the x, and you would subtract 7 from both sides. So I've also emailed you that lesson. If you need to repeat it, that's fine. You've got time for that. But we're going to move on to multiplying and dividing today. So here we have 15 equals 7x. So we have a number in front of the letter. And in your vocab, you saw that this number is called a coefficient. It is the number in front of x. And they're always being multiplied. So they're always being multiplied. So the opposite of multiplication would be division. And we'll get to that in just a second. So step one is you circle your I'm sorry, step one is you draw a line through the equal sign, then you circle your x. And then the opposite of multiplying 7 is going to be dividing by 7. So we're going to divide by 7 on both sides. That's that brother-sister rule. And 7 divided by 7 makes 1. And 1x one is just going to leave us with x. So we're going to mark that out. And just put x over here. And notice that the x is on the right, and that is okay. It doesn't matter which side the x is on. And then 15 sevenths can be your answer in a fraction. Or you can put it into a mixed number of 2 and 1 seventh. And we're not using the virtual manipulatives on these for Math Playground like we did before. But you do have a worksheet that's going to have one of those fill in the letters puzzle so that you can self-check that way. So here we had 7 times x. We divided both sides by 7. And it can be a fraction, a mixed number, or you can divide and get a decimal. The other thing you might see is division. So we've covered add, subtract, multiply, and now we have divide. So the fraction bar is the same thing as dividing. So we draw a line through our equal sign, we circle our x, and the opposite of dividing by 15 is multiplying by 15. And so we actually kind of do that to the side. And the opposite of Multiplying and dividing 15 results in us just crossing that out, and we have x over here. And then you go to the side and do, okay, well, what is 15 times 7? Let's see. 15 times 7. 7 times 5 is 35. And then 7 times 1 is 7, 8, 9, 10, so it's 105. So x is 105. And you can always check by doing 105 divided by 15, because remember, we're just looking for the mystery number that goes up here. So now you know how to add, subtract, multiply, and divide one-step equations. So you're doing the opposite, following those steps, and helping each other out today. Thank you very much.